Well, howdy, and what is happening, y'all? My name is Lomo Scorpio. Top notch, still guys. My name is Lomo, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Brigid. I'm an autistic content creator who has been at this for the past five years, and I have played games of many, many different kinds throughout the years, and created fictional characters as well. I've been playing GTA 5 online for the past eight years, and I've been playing it since its very, very early beginning days, all the way back in 2013. I've also played Dead by Daylight, of where I played Rain Around the Rosie with all the killers throughout my time playing the game, and especially playing mind games with them and completely duping them out. I played Overwatch, where I sniped off lots and lots of heads as my Overwatch fiance, Widowmaker. From creating Sherry the Sherman tank on War Thunder to doing tricks and stuns with monster trucks in Monster Jam Steel Titans. From playing Destiny 2, where I have created Carlia Croft. To Sea of Thieves where I have created Michelle, the strongest pirate girl in the world. Along with having created the Scarlet Bandit in Red Dead Redemption 2 Online, I've also been part of the Outlaw Gunslingers for almost three years. Hi, subscribers! Oh, yeah! Yep! Smash that like button! Oh, yeah, shout it. out to my friend Keenan here! Hey! My name is Brigham YT, and... Definitely do not forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications, and welcome to the channel. Hello everyone, Brigid here, and welcome back to Forza Horizon 5. Now, yes, I know it's been a while, but to those who have seen that video, I did... Uh, earlier, uh, a while ago, y'all know, well, y'all uh, already know what kept me from doing these videos. So anyway, we are back at Forza Horizon 5, and we are going to be taking a look, and perhaps, and perhaps doing a build, on the, uh, 2005, uh, MG X Power SVR. Currently packing 385 horsepower, 376 foot-pound of torque, and, overall, and an overall weight of 3,395 pounds. Now, I have never heard of this car, ever. So let's see how it sounds. Whoa. I can't tell if that's a V8 or a inline six. Okay, okay. Let's go. Ooh, that growl. Listen to that. Oh man, the growl of that. And it's automatic? Okay, right off the bat, this thing is slow. And because of that, it really, really needs upgrades. So let's get into it. Okay, so, twin turbos. Okay, put those on. Okay, just fully, uh... 
So, I'm now just fully maxing this thing out. Slammed like a biatch! Oh my god, I haven't said that in so long. One thousand horsepower, eight hundred and sixty-six foot-pound of torque, and and an overall weight of two thousand eight hundred and sixty-three pounds. This thing is down by a ton, flat one thousand horsepower. That is insane. Okay, this thing is definitely bound to be fast. And I mean really fast. <clears throat> if you fully lower it. Two hundred and forty one miles an hour. Okay, you know what? I am so okay with it. So now you know what? Let's take this thing to the highway. Here we go. <clears throat> Ooh, the shift sound. Two hundred and twenty miles per hour, or three hundred and fifty kilometers an hour. I forgot that this was here. <clears throat> Man, 1,000 horsepower. Just 1,000 horsepower and 866 foot-pound of torque in this thing. Now, can this thing drift, despite having all this power, can it drift? Well, there's only one way to find out. Here we go.
Okay, it's a bit squirrely when it comes to drifting. Apparently it's kind of a yes and a no, because it's really squirrely when it comes to drifting. Although I imagine that, that if you were to tune this thing right, you would definitely get way more out of it than I did. So that guys is going to wrap it up for the build and review of the uh, 2005 uh, MG X Power SVR. So thank y'all so much for watching. I really hope y'all enjoy this, and I will see y'all next time. Peace out.